welcome back to the lackluster channel. Today's video was submitted by Michael of the channel Good Citizen. On June 19th of 2021, Michael was in Del Rio, Texas when he noticed a crime scene blocked off by the Del Rio Police Department. He began recording this scene and almost immediately was approached by an officer. What's up everybody, this Good Citizen. Came across these guys that the street blocked off. I don't know what's going on. Let's check this out. Uh, Alright, sir. Alright, how are you doing? I'm not gonna argue with you. Mm -hmm. I just put it off. I'm gonna take it as evidence because this is being investigated right now. Well, there's our first amendment protected activity. Alright. Yeah. This is me. My name is. This is first amendment. And just like that, a world record was set for the shortest video to ever make it to the Lackluster channel. As always, thanks for watching. Wait, wait, wait. Unfortunately, the video ends there, but Michael alleges that the officer took a hold of his wrist, seized his phone, and demanded ID under threat of arrest. Meanwhile, other citizens recorded the scene as well, and it seems as though Michael was targeted for stepping up to the crime scene tape. Section 38.02 states that you must identify if lawfully detained or arrested, or if a police officer has a good cause to believe that you are a witness to a criminal offense. The officer seized Michael's phone, claiming it contained evidence and forced him to identify as if he was a witness. The officer gave Michael a receipt for his stolen property, but the officer's name was illegible. Officer Mayorka was later identified through an internal affairs investigation that, as usual, found no wrongdoing. Michael contacted multiple city officials and personnel within the police department. It took almost four months for Michael to have the DA release his phone containing nothing but a 10-second clip of Officer Mayorka allegedly abusing his power, assaulting a citizen, and stealing his phone. Let me know in the comments what you think of this interaction. Was the officer right to seize the phone as evidence, or was it a violation of Michael's First Amendment rights in retaliation for his filming? Michael's channel will be linked below. If you pay him a visit, let him know I sent you. As always, thanks for watching. If you have a video you'd like to submit for review, use the link in the description or pinned comment. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification for future content, and remember to like, share, and comment down below of what you think of this interaction. It really helps the channel. If you enjoy our content, try our other channels, Lackluster Limited for criminal psychology content, and The Odd Side for paranormal videos. Shirts and other merchandise are available at the Teespring store. Memberships start at just a buck if you'd like to help further support the channel and get a slick Lack logo next to your name. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. All links are down below.